It's not death that most people are afraid of. It's getting to their deathbed, realizing that you didn't truly live out your purpose. We've traveled the world in search of the greatest leaders of our generation. But do these leaders have some kind of gift? Some superpower? Do they have something unique about them that none of us possess? Or is the better question, how did they discover their power? And how can you tap into that? What I've learned on this journey is that all great leaders throughout humanity have learned how to hack their consciousness. And they all point us within. See, the truth is, we're the most connected generation in history because of technology. Yet we are the most disconnected with each other and with ourselves. It may seem that we are living in a chaotic time, but the reality is our generation is waking up. For those of you watching this message right now, you are the leaders, the ones that need to wake up first. Humanity is facing an epidemic. We are plagued by fear. It has become the predominant emotion of our planet. Fear of rejection, fear of not being good enough, fear of not being loved, the fear of failure. But the fear that scares me the most is that we continue to sleepwalk during our short time here on Earth, never truly waking up to make our dreams a reality. We have these fears and anxieties because we swing on the pendulum of time into the future, into the past, never stopping to acknowledge the present. You see, all of us are walking forward with this mirror in front of us, looking backwards, yet all we really need to do is look within. Stop looking out into the world for answers and start looking within yourself. The world is going through a massive change. Our planet is shifting back into a generation of consciousness and human connection. For this to happen, we must know that in order for us to change the world, we must change oneself. The day that you realize that you have the ability to master your mind, your beliefs, and your imagination will be the moment that you experience the abundance of what's truly possible in your world. This truth will be the most momentous of your entire life. It will be the day that you initiate ownership of your destiny. Understand that your feelings create your thoughts, your thoughts create your feelings, your feelings create your actions, and this is how you create your reality. See, the mind is the key to manifestation. It is the master key to the human gate, the two worlds between reality as you see it and the truth of what you believe it to be. The path that you've been made to believe makes you successful is no path at all. It's actually a system, and it's a system that has brainwashed us. Brainwashed by the corporations, technology, our governments, food, the chemicals, even our education system, but mostly by our society. All without our conscious consent. Our current culture has been one of hacking our minds to confine us into a box, program us, and control our beliefs. What they wanted us to believe is that we're part of a culture. But the reality is, we're part of a systematic cult. Sure. It has made a generation to believe you are a helpless victim that needs to turn to the outside world for answers. But we can choose to stop. We can choose a different direction. You can choose to become more aware, more responsible, more conscious. We can choose to stop sitting here like a blank CD, downloading every program that the world hands to us and wake up. We need to recognize that this is how we go from being victims to conscious creators and leaders of a new earth. The purpose of this video is to help you locate within yourself the power that lies asleep. So you may be wondering, what does it mean to become more conscious, more aware, to become awakened? To begin with, becoming more conscious means starting to look for the truth within ourselves instead of blindly allowing us to be programmed by the outside world or the inner voice within our mind. Becoming more conscious means gaining mastery over your fears that have blocked your most important life experiences that you have been missing out on until now. There is one thing that the world does not want us to find out and that is the truth about ourselves. Why? 
because that's the day that we become free. We can no longer be controlled, manipulated, exploited, drained, enslaved, imprisoned, and disempowered. Therefore, the inner voyage of discovery is cloaked over with an aura of forbidding and mastery. The real truth is that if we go within and discard one illusion after another, one negative program after another, it gets lighter and lighter. The awareness of the presence of love becomes stronger and stronger, and we feel lighter and lighter as life becomes progressively more effortless. You are a gift, and it is a tidal wave of light ascending into you as you ascend into it. It is time you took control of your power. You find who you truly are and find your soul in this universe. It is time you discover your leader within. Take a moment to step out of the matrix and let this all sink in because I invite you to step into your highest power. I invite you to create a new reality and take this walk with me on this journey within. Till season four, your boy G, the millennial mentor. I love you. Peace.